Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today in the diary room, Cross was having a conversation with Big Brother. And of course, as he was having that conversation, he was really angry at the fact that, you know, Perry walked up to White Mini and of course that led to the heated clash they had overnight. And we could hear Cross saying that if it was him and Perry walked up to him like that and they were outside of the house, he would literally have given Perry a headboot. So yeah, he was very, very upset and very, very mad. And if we were outside the house, Honestly, I would have headbutted him if he had come to me that way. I would headbutt him because he has no right to. He doesn't pay my school fee. He doesn't, he doesn't feed me. Why would he do that kind of thing? That's unnecessary. That's evil. That's an evil act right there. So to me, I was very, very upset. So Cross was so pissed that it got to a particular point the big brother had to tell him to take a deep breath. In front of you. That don't... That doesn't look like you're about to lose your bed because your belt was uncomfortable. You lose your bed because you're about to use it and smash him. I literally saw that coming. But I don't know, maybe he thought about it and he decided not to. Until now, he's still feeling that he's still right, he's still standing in the ground. Man. Cross. Yes, big brother. Kindly take a deep breath. Moving on to my next gist. Boma met with Perry today and asked him to apologize because of the perception of him that he has created outside of the house. And here we see that Perry says he hasn't done anything wrong. I didn't touch him, I didn't shove him, I didn't pin him down. There was no physical contact at all. Zero. And even along the while when he was talking, I didn't even raise my voice to reply. I was just calm. I was just looking at him like this. While he was the one reeking and reeking and shouting and shouting and reeking. I do not nothing. People that say I'm not. Of course. So they keep they changed our battery yesterday. So then Two more gist and I'll be out of your faces. Angel has come to say that with the powers given to Maria to nominate two people who she's going to evict on Sunday, that regardless of whatever it is, regardless of the fact that people are meant to impress Maria so that they don't get on those two lists on Sunday, she will not kiss Maria's ass as she's just going to live a normal life and if she leaves on Sunday, so be it. Big brother, I won't lie to you. I have no idea. Like, I don't know what I'm supposed to do except continue doing what I've been doing. I can't force shit. That's it. I don't intend on kissing ass either to remain in the house. So, I mean, I'm just going to do, and like I said, anything we want, so people so period, like. But of course, it's the contrary when it came to Jackie B. Jackie B said, come on, if I have to kiss Maria's ass till Sunday just to stay in this house, why not? She's going to do it. It's just for one week, right? Of course, it is what it is. What? We're supposed to impress her? We're supposed to impress one housemate for a whole week to stay in this house? Ah, that thing we came well, I can't even lie. I was like, what the hell? So we're supposed to be kissing this girl's ass. She's cool, I love her, but I'm sorry, she's been kissing her ass for the week so I can stay in the game. But I mean, we'll do what we need to do. You know what, there's always a first, with Big Brother, there's always a first for us to kiss us. Kiss us. Jackie B also went ahead to tell Big Brother that she's not in a relationship with Michael and that whatever it is, whatever news people are carrying out there, she's not in a relationship with Michael. I'd like to discuss anything else with Big Brother? Um. Okay, so Michael's situation, and everybody's looking at us and feeling like, oh, this is a sheep. Please, I'm not a sheep, it's Michael. That's what I wanted to say. I'm not in any sheep. Now I'm beginning to wonder, is this because of the fact that, you know, she has experienced Boma, even Boma were the head of house and deputy head of house at some point, and of course, they even started calling themselves babies, right? And now, when Michael came into the house, straight off she reported to Michael. But right now, she sees that Michael is not a guy who will probably be with one girl, and now, Boma has chosen her again to be the guest to share the head of house room with him because that was what Maria wanted. But of course, it was coincidental, right? And here she is in the diary telling Big Brother, you know what, I'm not in a relationship with Michael. So I'm beginning to wonder that is this because right now she's found her way back to Boma in the head of house lounge and she's observed that Michael is not the kind of guy she wants to be with? Finally, before I leave, I'm going to leave you with this hilarious video from these two people who were praying. We are going to pray. Oh, yes, we are going to say, mm. Father. Father. We are going to say, Father. Father. Every spirit of every spirit of pain. In the life of white money. In the life of be white money. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. In the name of Jesus. Every spirit of pain. In the life of white money. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. In the name of Jesus. Every spirit of pain. In the life of white money. Be destroyed. In the name of Jesus. Be evicted. Be evicted. Spirit of pain. Be evicted. Be 
Thank you so much guys for watching. Please, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please hit the subscribe button, turn on your notification bell so you guys will get notified whenever I post a video. Go on our social media platforms on Facebook and Instagram and Twitter and of course on TikTok and follow me at the Femi Daniel. And until next time, I come with very soon. It's bye for now.